so that scalar product of two vectors is invariant under rotation consider two vectors a and b suppose vector a is equal to i cap ax plus j cap ay plus k cap az where ax ay and az are components of the vector along x y and z axis respectively similarly i cap is the unit vector along x j cap is the unit vector along y and k cap is the unit vector along z similarly b vector can be represented by i cap bx plus j cap by plus k cap bz so what will be the scalar product of the two vectors scalar product of two vectors or dot product of two vectors a dot b will be equal to or when you take the dot product only i dot i that will be equal to 1 j dot j will be equal to 1 k dot k will be equal to 1 and other dot products that is i dot j or i dot k like this they will be equal to 0 so a dot b will be equal to ax bx plus ay by plus az bz suppose this is equation number 1 and in the question it is given that you have to show that scalar product of two vectors is invariant under rotation suppose the vector rotates about z axis then uh, after rotation suppose uh, at an angle theta the vector will be a prime and b prime and a prime vector is equal to i cap ax ax prime plus j cap ay prime plus k cap az prime and b vector will be b prime vector after rotation that will be equal to i cap bx prime plus j cap by prime plus k cap bz prime in the previous video we have proved that if a vector rotates at an angle theta about z axis then the um, a, 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 a x prime that means the a x vector after rotation uh, rotating an angle theta it will be a x prime will be equal to a x cos theta plus a y sin theta similarly a y prime will be equal to minus a x sin theta plus a y cos theta since the vector is rotating about z axis then a z prime will be equal to a z and similarly the b x vector will be converted into b x prime vector after rotation so b x prime will be equal to b x cos theta plus b y sin theta b y prime will be equal to minus b x sin theta plus b y cos theta and b z prime will be equal to b z and we will see what will be the dot product after rotation after rotation the dot product will be equal to a prime dot b prime that will be equal to x prime into b x prime plus a y prime b y prime plus a z prime b z prime and we have here taken a x prime is equal to x cos theta plus a y sin theta so put the value of a x prime b x prime a y prime b y prime a z prime b, b z prime so you will get this uh, this uh, uh, after the substitution so after substitution you got this now you take the product a, the first product will be ax bx into cos square theta here ax bx into cos square theta plus the second product will be ax by sin theta into cos theta the third product will be equal to ay bx into sin theta into cos theta this one the fourth one will be equal to ay by sin square theta this one similarly the product of this and this will be equal to minus ax here minus bx so ax bx sin theta into sin theta sin square theta similarly minus ax by into sin cos theta minus ax into by into cos theta again here you have also sin theta the third product here will be equal to ay by bx minus ay bx into cos theta into sin theta this one the fourth one will be 
ए वाई बी वाई कॉस स्क्वायर थीटा सो ए वाई बी वाई कॉस स्क्वायर थीटा एंड दिस वन ए जेड बी जेड एंड हियर यू सी ए एक्स बी एक्स कॉस स्क्वायर थीटा एंड आल्सो यू हैव ए एक्स बी एक्स साइन स्क्वायर थीटा दिस दिस टू फ्रॉम दिस टू इफ यू टेक कॉमन ए एक्स बी एक्स इन द ब्रैकेट यू हैव साइन स्क्वायर थीटा प्लस कॉस स्क्वायर थीटा व्हिच इज इक्वल टू 1 सो विल गेट ए एक्स बी एक्स सिमिलरली यू हैव also a y uh, b y sin square theta here also a y b y cos square theta so if you take common a y b y in the bracket you have sin square theta plus cos square theta which which will be equal to 1 and uh, so you will get a y b y and here you see a x b y sin theta into cos theta okay a x b y sin theta into cos theta Here minus x b y sin theta into cos theta, so this will cancel. This will cancel. Similarly, a y b x sin theta cos theta. Here a y b x sin theta cos theta. This is negative and this is positive, so this will also cancel. So only we have a z b z. Okay. Suppose this is equation number two, and in equation one you see, in equation one you have shown that. a dot b is equal to a x b x plus a y b y plus a z b z and in equation two you see equation two we have proved that uh, after rotation a um, a prime dot b prime dot is equal to a x b x plus a y b y plus a z b z so this proves that the scalar product of two vectors is invariant under rotation.